Anyway, I decided to do a video with you all with my handgun. It's clear. And I, I have this here because I need to ask you all a question. I've, I'm at sort of an internal debate in my mind. I can either, or I need to put my rifle project to the side for right now. Um, just no, low, low budget stuff is not going to work with building a rifle. Man, I, it's come to my attention. I probably should put a little bit more work into the thing I actually carry on me that I have a higher chance of using every day, uh, every day because it's just because bad stuff can happen, and this is going to be what's on me or near me. Um, first off, I'm going to need to work on the sights because these are the just a typical stock Glock plastic soccer ball in the field post sights. I can use them just fine, hit what I'm aiming at, but still, it's just not preferable at all. Um, I'm looking into getting Ameriglo, some Ameriglo um, fiber optic sights for $40 off Amazon. You know, blacked out rear, red dot on the front. Um, I'm not going tritium because that, that, those cost a little too much. And if I put a light under here, which I will do, um, I've heard conflicting opinions on whether or not um, tritiums will actually work for you. Or will actually are actually worth the money, I should say. Um, so forty dollars can replace the sights, and I've used that those styles of sights before. They were great. They were great for me. I'll just have to install them and all that, um, and just get something that's a little get a, some sighting that works a little bit be better than the soccer ball and goalpost stuff. I should probably put a little bit mon more money into that. But also, on top of that, I have something else conflicting. This ammo that I've had in it, it's a federal, it's like the federal HST 124 grains. Um, I've had this ammo and this gun for two years, may, maybe pushing three. And I haven't bought any more defensive ammo to put through it. Yeah, I'm not sure. I've heard the firearms guy advises like once every season to replace, to get new defensive ammo for your handgun, but budget isn't too friendly to that. Um, but I'm looking into getting some Federal Plus P 124 grain HST rounds. Basically, same bullet, hotter powder behind it. Um, the Glock itself can take the. Uh, the Glock itself can take the plus P rounds as it covers my face. So I, I think I, I think the plus P rounds will be, um, probably serve me better, um, if I have to use it. I believe I found a box, I could find a box or two online of like a 50 count of these for like $30, I believe. Somewhere around that range. Could be 25, could be 35, let's say 30. Um... So I'm looking into getting that. The only problem is I have to get it offline, which means I've got to pay shipping and all that stuff. But um, I'm making this video to mainly giving you that long explanation to ask you, ask you all your opinion. Which is more important, new defensive ammo or new sights? In my mind, I'm leaning towards the ammo because I can use these sights. Not neither of these right now are preferable. They're just okay. But I think being able to throw better qual uh, if I had to use it defensively, throwing better um, better quality ammo that might that has a better probability of doing the job it needs to do is probably a little bit more important than preferable sites because I can use these just fine. I can use these just fine, or just it's just not preferable for the purposes I need. So I, I but I'm making this video to ask you all. Which should I go for first, the ammo or the sights? Leave your answer in the comments below, um, or make a VR for me. Why not? Uh, I like I like watching YouTube videos, obviously. So leave me a response or a video response. Maybe just comment what you think. Give me the reasons why too. I don't like just I don't like just hearing answers. I like hearing why. To my curious mind, I prefer to hear the why instead of just the statement. So what? Well, uh, with that, with that question, I'll remind you all to walk Christian walk and carry a loaded.